Vinny Magalhães. Magalhães, come on. <laughs> it's the hardest name ever. Let me try again. Aaron True, Truman May Show here with my good buddy, Vinny Magalhães. That was bad, right? Close. Okay, so you're currently the 205-pound M1 Global Champion. How does it feel to have the belt? You know, having a belt like feels really good, but uh, I think the biggest thing for me is be like in a you know in a winning streak. That's the biggest thing for me that like last year. So yeah, having the belt's awesome, but for me like you know not being like in a winning losing winning losing situation anymore, uh, it's way feels way better. Do you have any special news about your gi jiu jitsu or your teaching or what's going on with you? Yeah, um, I'm actually like quitting tap out. Like tomorrow's my last last class at tap out. I'm going to extreme cool tour. Which I've been training there already, you know, like I've been there for like since 2008, since I started training for the finale uh, against Bader. And then uh, now I'm gonna be actually working at Cool Tours as well. And now uh, we started like a new gear program there, something they never had even when Drive Day was there. They just had like the, the no gear program. Now I'm gonna be the very first guy to teach a gear program at Cool, at cool Tours. Yeah. Do you feel like you're gonna bring a lot to the table in terms of uh, your gi jiu jitsu and helping them for their train their jiu jitsu for their MMA? Uh, I wouldn't say just for jiu jitsu, just for the, the sports side of it, but also for MMA, you know, because uh, people have to realize that I'm not like that traditional guy who's gonna say jiu jitsu with the gi is better, but I feel like for people that don't know much about like ground game, uh, gi is a good start. And I feel like, you know, I'm gonna have like a bunch of those upcoming guys like starting with me with the gi. And they eventually they're just gonna get better than the guys that just started with with all the gears. So you know that's the biggest challenge for me. The biggest thing for me now is people recognizing my, my skills. You know, like so yeah, his jutsu actually translates into MMA. That was another thing too. People would be like, uh, his jutsu is not good for MMA. It's like no, dude, my MMA is not good for MMA. It's nothing to do with the jutsu because I take to the ground and finish people on the ground. The problem was like take people to the ground. And now you know I'm not having that problem anymore. I'm winning my fight. So you know I want to thank people that support me. And even those that hate me, you know they used to hate me or you still hate me because you know those are the people that actually that makes me like want the most, so win the most. Viewers at home may have seen there was an incident with yourself and I in the cage one time where we grappled and I was getting the better view. I thought I thought I was winning and then suddenly next thing you know I'm asleep. What the hell happened with that? You know, like, I don't know if you're winning, dude. You got to fly arm boat twice. And what else? I actually let it start on my back and end up, like, submitting it. So I don't know if you were, like, winning. Well, thank you for the time. I wish you the best of luck in the future, and we'll continue to follow your career. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you.